The McDonald's All-American Game will take place in Atlanta on March 27th. This All-Star Game reserved only for the top high school basketball players in the country. Yeah, one player who made the roster will represent the Hoosiers next year. Our Megan McEwen has the story. 800 high school seniors from around the country nominated to play in the McDonald's All-American Game. Only 24 selected. One of those 24? Trace Jackson Davis. I've really thought about it since a young age. Uh, being one of the top 24 players was just really a goal for me, especially coming out of last year. So just trying to work hard and try to be my best on the court and off the court, and it helped. So I thought it was a real blessing, honestly. He's really worked hard to put himself in this position and look forward to him getting better and better, but definitely, definitely proud. The number one player in the state of Indiana had offers from countless universities. However, he decided to stay close to home. Just because Coach Ostrom and Coach Archie made me a priority from day one, um, me and Keon Brooks were the two players that they have really went after really hard for, and Armand Franklin too, but us two, like, since the start that they got here, that's the two players that they really considered hard coming at. So and then just playing for your hometown and in, uh, Indiana on in the front of your chest, so that was really big for me. Check McDonald's All-American off the list. However, Trace Jackson Davis still has two more achievements he'd like to mark off before his high school career is all said and done. It was one of my biggest goals, that, and then win a state championship in Mr. Basketball were my three goals for this year. So I got one of them, and then the other two are still on the table. So just check one off the list and keep going for the next two. The journey for a state title begins next Tuesday. <laughs> Megan McEwen, Wish TV News 8. Hope he helps out the Hoosiers next year. Hey.